Welcome back to Reimagine 2020. I'm Yona Hockhauser, and this is everything you need to know about the cryptosphere in 90 seconds or less for December 21st, powered by Multi.io. After weeks of intense negotiations, congressional leaders have finally reached a deal on a $900 billion coronavirus relief package that will include a second round of direct payments to U.S. households. Expect $600 stimulus checks per adult and child and billions to go towards businesses and paycheck protection programs. This also means that there will now be billions of dollars available to be reinvested in the crypto market. I think people should start looking at US printing of money in 2020 like they looked at Tether in 2017. Yeah, there's a centralized organization that gets to print as much of their currency as they want with no real value backing it, but on the plus side, it pumps the market with a whole lot more dollars to buy Bitcoin with. With Bitcoin now trailing at its all-time high, keep that money printer going burr, baby! You know what sucks? Buying a hardware wallet to make sure your crypto is secure and in your hands, and then the company you bought that hardware wallet from gets hacked, and all your personal information, including your full name, phone number, email, and home address, is leaked onto the internet for everyone to see, so you could start getting endless phishing scams texted and emailed to you, and oh, every criminal knows where you live. Yep, that is what's happening right now to Ledger's clients, and they ain't happy, and they're probably gonna sue. Ledger, you had one job, man, one job. Oh, and if you didn't hear, once again, very exciting news, Elon Musk mentioned the word Bitcoin, Bitcoin, Bitcoin. You're now officially free to lose your shit. For Reimagine 2020, I'm Yona Hakazo. That was everything you need to know in 90 seconds. Make sure to check back here for all the latest blockchain news, interviews, and more. Peace.